Uh, Michelle Bachman is on uh, American Family Association's radio show. Apparently, they have a radio show. Uh, and she's talking to Sandy Rios, who's going to ask her about Obamacare. Oh, well. Well, it, like, it looks like that ship has sailed, right? No, no, no. For the right wing, it has never sailed. And Michelle Bachman has a unique idea about how they can overturn. Do you th see any path, any path, in which we could, in spite of all the horrible stories that are coming out now and the, where, the awareness that's coming to the regular Americans about how bad this was, just as you said it was going to be, any path of stopping it? You know, I really do. I, I believe that, that God listens to his people, and I think his believers humble themselves, confess their sins, and pray. I think God hears from us, hears our hearts, and he moves. He moves in miraculous ways. It isn't a guarantee. We've got to do a lot of work between now and then, particularly on our knees in prayer. On your knees in prayer. That's fascinating. Uh, well, uh, if God was on your side, why didn't he just vote it down in the first place? Hmm, things that make you go, hmm. Well, God works in mysterious ways. He really wanted to mess with the right wing for a long, long time, have them pass this law, have it go into effect, have the Supreme Court uh, go in the opposite direction, and then at the end, when Michelle Bachman's on her knees, he's like, bingo, that's what I was looking for. More prayers, that's it. I will strike it down. Now, how's he going to strike it down? Who knows? But clearly, God is on uh, Michelle Bachman's side. And by the way, don't get me wrong, I love this strategy. I want him to use this strategy. I don't want them to fight legislatively. I just want them to get on their knees and be like, oh, Lord, help us. Good luck with that strategy. <laughs> okay. Um, well, by the way, one of the things she mentioned in the interview, she said that uh, if Hillary Clinton wins the White House in 2016, we will certainly see socialized medicine. Wait a minute. I thought we already saw socialized medicine. Didn't you say Obamacare was socialized medicine? Well, now that it's been implemented and people see that it is not socialized medicine, you're not being, you know, yeah, walked over to a government department where you wait hours in line to see a government doctor, well, they can't say that lie anymore. Now they say, oh, but if you get the next Democrat, that's when it's going to be socialized medicine. Oh, okay, right. Now, I wouldn't take uh, what Michelle Bachman says, of course, too seriously. She is a goofy person. Speaking of which, I recently got this uh, sent to me on Twitter and asking me to put a caption on it. Well, let's take a look at Michelle Bachman. Now, it's not a recent picture, but we're having fun in this story. This is from when she was campaigning in 2012. Don't do that. <laughs> okay, don't do that. I don't know why they do that when they're campaigning. Anyway, my caption would be, Marcus told me to do it this way. <laughs> That's wrong. That's wrong. 